Hi everyone, welcome to the next in our series on Amazon. Today we're going to be looking at how to create your shipping plan. Everything to do with Amazon is a giant pain in the ass and the shipping plan is no different, but stick with us and over the next few minutes I'll show you how to do it the easy way, get it right the first time. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to set up a shipping plan for your first FBA product to Amazon. Here, I've like you can see here, I've logged into my Seller Central account, and I have this. It's a dummy for this purpose, but an item I've created here: some little doggy donuts. And if we scroll across, it's a six pack of doggy donuts, and I'm going to send in seventy five six packs we come across here to edit I'm going to change that to fulfilled by Amazon and it comes straight to this page now for most of you I'd suggest that we want to switch to an Amazon Amazon barcode which means we'll get our printed shipping labels when we get to the end of this process so we now say tick on the convert and send inventory okay we're back now we've got to choose from individual products or case packed products now if you're doing private label I expect that you will be using case packed products so that's you know a half a dozen or a dozen of your private label product in a box or a case rather than a dozen different products in one box or case so we tick case packed products if you're not sure what that is you got the little Amazon help window here which explains exactly what I just meant went through with you so we tick case packed products continue to shipping plan okay now you want to show the FNSQ quantity of units all right we'll make that there's 25 units per case and there's three cases and this is in the manufacturer's original packaging so the size of each of my little boxes of doggy donuts and I'll say it's 25 by 15 by 5 centimeters so we save that and we continue next page talks about all the prep now saying prep may be required and tells you to check out the Amazon preferred product prep and shipping supply store in my situation that's not required you know it comes up saying prep may be required which it's not we then go to all products oh, I need to do this choose category and that comes up we pick no prep needed and click on the choose button we now go to click the continue and keep working through the process okay this is a good page now it's saying this is where we're up to printing our labels so doggy donuts it's a six pack there's 75 of these six packs who labels is it the merchant or it's Amazon it is the merchant normally if you're doing private labeling it will be you I want 75 of these labels and we're going to pick up the smallest we can use which is the 48.5 by 25.4 on A4 paper and we're going to print labels for this page they're downloading now we'll have a look at those here we go there is our labels so you send that to your manufacturer they print those on uh, label paper that you can buy quite cheaply and stick them on your product it's that simple we come back here and click on continue now we've got our labels and this is just going through the process inventory you send to Amazon may be split into different shipments we will assign each shipment to a specific fulfillment center based on several factors 
etc 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 so I won't go through and click on this approve shipment because I'm not actually going to be shipping any of these and Amazon will get very very cranky with me if I do but uh, you can see if you just click through on the approve shipment you end up the next stage is printing your address labels which again will come down in a PDF file that you send to your manufacturer who prints them off and sticks them on the cases or the big boxes with all your products in it okay that's it for now i hope that helps you out um, feel free to come back and check that out again and don't forget if you are finding these videos useful hit the subscribe button at the bottom of the page and we'll see you again soon this is ian from inknable.com